Hi guys, it's Monday. I completely forgot that I was gonna start another work week in my life vlog um, this week. So it's actually a Monday night, it's 9.15, but I figured I would go ahead and start this vlog because I did wanna do another week in my life for this week. I basically just went to work this morning and I actually met up with one of my friends and her, well, fiance, about to be husband, because me and John are actually doing a photo and video for their wedding, uh, which is super exciting. So we got to catch up with them and kind of just go over some wedding stuff and we went to Chili's for dinner. So I just got home, I actually have to do some laundry. Uh, and as you can see, I just like threw everything on my bed when I got home. So I need to kind of pick up my room, pretty much what I do in like every single vlog, but it's fine. But yeah, I was gonna do, I usually try and do laundry on Sundays, like Sunday nights, but I end up just getting, I think I just pulled the threads out of my jeans. Great, my black jeans I wear like every day. I just pulled a thread out of but anyways i i usually like to do laundry on sundays but last night i just like we got home really late and i just didn't feel like it i was super tired i actually got pretty good sleep last night because i was able to just go right to bed i'm gonna go ahead and do my laundry now um i was thinking i might take a bath but i probably won't i think i'm just gonna get a shower and just chill out and get in comfy clothes when it comes to like wedding planning stuff we're kind of in um kind of like a break time i guess you have to start getting like a registry together and um just kind of like the rest of the vendors so i might look into a little bit of that tonight um, work has been pretty busy but i feel like i've been having some like really good and productive days cute pictures again and like get back into like having cute instagram pictures and i don't know i feel like my feed is all over the place i know that sounds so stupid but i really love just like taking pictures especially if like doing um like a lot of fashion stuff and just cute outfits and i just feel like kind of like i'm not like my editing's all over the place and i just want it to look really consistent and like minimal um, which I need to like focus more on because I feel like my Instagram's like really like warm toned right now and I want to make it a little more neutral. If you're not like into like taking pictures on Instagram, you probably think I sound insane, but it's actually like really bothering me because I'm like, oh, I just want to like have good pics to post and I haven't lately. It's just when I'm like working every day, it's like I can't just like go out and shoot like during the day, it has to be on a weekend and then I'm usually pretty busy on the weekends. So we were going to go yesterday shopping um, at the mall and go to like restoration hardware because I do want to like look at their uh stuff just kind of get like inspo and um they obviously have like the really cute like outside part and I was gonna take pictures there yesterday but we ended up getting out like really late and I forgot it was a Sunday so they closed at six I feel like everything in life is pretty much together and I have um like work stuff is going good wedding stuff everything's kind of like going into place but I always get in this rut where I'm not really like prioritizing um like my photography business which I like go through phases where I like post a lot and I have like everything together and then other times I'm just like I get so busy with everything else that I forget so I'm trying to get that together like I feel like that's always a thing and then like my own personal stuff which I know it sounds stupid but I'm like oh I want to have like my own like branding and Instagram and stuff together I'm caught up on YouTube for the moment but I also feel like I'm kind of like I like to watch like work vlogs and just like vlogs of people's everyday life but I feel like a lot of my subscribers like watch specific things for me like it's either like my college stuff or more like my sit down videos I think people are like actually more interested in so I need to figure out some more at sit down videos to film soon it's just I really like doing the vlogs but um I don't know if like anyone else cares like wants to see it so I don't know part of me like feels kind of discouraged because I'm like, why would I keep filming vlogs if no one really cares? But I'm doing them for me anyways and I like looking back on them. So I'm gonna keep doing what I'm doing. I have, um, I think I've talked about this. I have a bunch of like wedding series videos that I want to film soon. So there definitely will be more um, like specific videos coming up soon. But yeah, I kind of want to just take the night and like maybe do like some Pinterest, like looking on Pinterest and kind of getting picture ideas. And I don't know, that's just like my interest and my hobby is just having cute outfits, taking cute pictures. And I feel like I haven't been able to do that lately um, just with being so busy. So I really wanna be able to prioritize that a little more. And uh, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna start some laundry. It's already getting kind of late, but whatever. John was there at our dinner tonight, but I usually go over to his house on Tuesdays. So I'm assuming I'll go over there tomorrow. Last week, last Friday, I actually, after work, I just brought like some workout clothes and I ended up running on Bayshore and like the Riverwalk, which is right next to my work downtown. And I'm just able to like have a really nice scenic route and um, get some running in. So I wanna start trying to at least do that for a little bit, like every day after work if I can. Cause it's like, I'm already up. I could just do it right when I'm done working and it's not a matter of like getting up and going to the gym. But it was really nice because that Friday we actually like did both. Like I did the running and then I got to John's and we went to the gym as well. So I think that's a really good opportunity for me to start getting my exercise in. So I do wanna bring up my stuff tomorrow because I think we will probably do the same thing, try and do both. And I actually ran like a little bit, probably too far last time. I was probably running for 45, 
50 minutes and I think I did a total of almost like four miles so I can definitely like shorten that route and not go like as far but and I also like run in intervals like I kind of do like sprints and then I walk um that's just like the way I've always liked doing it I know a lot of people like um like long distance running or running like slower for a longer period of time I've never been able to like do that I just love sprinting and then like taking a breather and walking it's just what works for me and I think it's kind of good like the hit workout kind of thing it's supposed to like get your heart rate and I think it might be like even more beneficial to do like um interval whenever you're running I feel like I'm touching my hair way too much so I'm just gonna get prepared for tomorrow and the rest of the week and hopefully stick to that routine of um even if I just walk for a little bit um since I'm already right there and have such a pretty route like I might as well do it I also did not realize in that last clip how close I was to the camera it seemed like I was a lot further back so <laughs> sorry for that like I said, I need a new lens uh, for vlogging, uh, but yeah, I haven't gotten around to that yet. I actually like always thought this camera was kind of heavy compared to my old Canon, but I've been using a Canon 5D Mark IV at work, and it's actually so much heavier, and I have like big lens on that, so this is like so light compared to that. But yeah, I do need a better lens for at least like vlog style, so sorry for being all up in the camera. I just took my shower and my toe actually feels like super broken. If you don't know, I broke my toe in September, October. I think it was very end of September or beginning of October. And I think I've already talked about this, but I let it heal, I thought. I kept taping it. They tell you you're supposed to tape it to your other toe. And it has just felt so weird lately and like not in place, <laughs> which is not good. So... I guess I'm just gonna keep taping it. I feel like I can totally feel like a bump on it compared to this toe. But I ran out of the surgical tape that I've been using and honestly, okay, well I ran out of the one from when I went to the doctor and then my like mom had some that I used and it just like sucked. Like it would not stay sticky to itself and it was just always coming off. So John gave me the sports tape that he has. It seems so like thick when it's like double the width, I think. I don't know, but I need to keep wrapping it. I guess I need some scissors. I'm just like so confused and bothered and like hope my toe is okay. I just got out of work um i put my shoes on and just got ready in my car and i'm about to go out running um like i said just like the area around my work because it's such like a nice view and a route to run on um so yeah i'm gonna do that and we are still planning to go to the gym tonight so i'm hoping i can stick with this new routine and yeah just gonna feel good to get out and be on my feet and i really like that i decided to start doing this so Hopefully it goes well. I'm feeling a little bit like hungry and kind of weak, so like I might not um, go too far or do too much, but we'll see. So I'm at John's now. Run was good. I didn't go as far as I did last time. Why are you about to throw a banana peel at me? You can't see it, but he's gonna throw a banana peel at me. Oh yeah, parked in the driveway, just kidding. I thought I didn't, because it landed on the pass. You have to put this visitor pass up if you park anywhere in his neighborhood. And I was like, oh, I didn't put the pass up, but it's because I parked in his driveway. But yeah, I didn't go as far as I did the other day, but I kind of explained that, like I wasn't really feeling the best. I didn't want to like do too much. I mean, it was almost the same. Well, no, about a half mile difference. The first day I went 3.63 miles and today I went 3.11 miles, but, and I was only like five minutes quicker. 
I definitely like don't run the whole time. I think I could explain that too. I kind of like sprint and then do walking in between. But today even more so, I like walked a lot more because my shins hurt so bad. I always get shin splints when I run. I don't know what it is. I just, I can't do it, especially outside. Like if I'm doing outdoor running, I feel like it's even worse than like if I were to do it on the treadmill. But I like it. I love running and I'm like, oh, it just hurts. But it was good overall. I'm glad I got moving and I just need to stay on my feet and then go to the gym because if I sit down, it's over. I don't feel as hungry as I did when I got off work, so I was like feeling really weak and like I needed to eat something. But even though I don't like, feel really hungry, I'm still gonna eat something. So I think I'm gonna cook an egg because I feel like I need protein. So that's like what I don't eat enough of. So I'm just gonna eat that now, just have some more energy for when we do go to the gym and then we'll come back and have a dinner. I think we're doing like salad, chicken, right? Do you wanna do that? So on the health grind, we'll see how long it lasts because we go through phases and then it doesn't stick all the time. But yeah, I never just like make an egg, but I'm going to now. We're mixing colors because we have white ones left. <laughs> Yum. Gym was a success, right? Dinner is served. Salads with chicken, grapes, strawberries, and apples. Healthy. So I wanted to do a little update. Today was um, obviously like not a very good day for vlogging. It is now one in the morning and I like barely vlogged today. I think I just took like a couple clips on my phone of me um, driving to work and then for dinner. So yeah, it was just one of those days I was really busy and I was gonna either run or walk after work cause like my legs are really hurting, my shins. Uh, I think I talked about like how that happens. I get shin splints really bad, but I forgot my socks. So that didn't happen because I got was about to run with no socks on, that's gross. So I just skipped out on today and I'm gonna hopefully pick it back up tomorrow. I just wasn't feeling well like in general and I just didn't wanna be like straightening my legs more than I have to because I don't wanna like potentially get like a stress fracture or whatever. So I just took today off and um, I got home and my mom actually made a dinner. John came over and had picadillo, which is, it's like ground beef with um, like tomato sauce, olive, uh, bay leaves. It's like a Cuban thing. Uh, it's definitely one of my like favorite meals. It's so good. And we don't have it that often actually, but my mom makes it so good. And then we just watched um, the Captain America Winter Soldier with my parents because we've been on like this um, Marvel marathon where we're watching all of them in like timeline order. Uh, after we finished WandaVision, we were like, oh my God, we wanna watch all of them like in the order they're supposed to like make sense chronologically. So we've been through all the ones in the beginning. I think it started with um, Captain Marvel and then Captain America, Iron Man, I don't know, there's like a list of them in order. So now we're on, um, I think I'd like to say we're like halfway through, maybe a little behind, uh, like the halfway point. But yeah, I'm just accepting that it's gonna be a late night tonight. I've really been into like going to bed at like 11.30 midnight if possible. Um, I just have been like valuing trying to get like a lot of sleep, but it's already one o'clock and I actually have to wash my hair. As you can see, it's like really gross. So I definitely wanted to do this earlier, but it didn't happen. But yeah, I just wanted to do a little update since I didn't obviously vlog at all today, really. But yeah, I'm just going to take a shower, get in bed, and I will pick up the vlog tomorrow. Didn't forget my socks today, so I'm about to head out on a walk slash run um, downtown. And I guess we'll see how much I actually run because my legs. And then hopefully also going to the gym after when I get home um, to John's. Gym. This is the routine now. Dinner. We were gonna. <laughs> I thought we were doing chicken, but I come here and he thawed steak too, so I guess we're gonna have a little bit of both. And then we have peppers, onions, broccoli, and then a little pasta side. So pretty healthy until the pasta, but it's not done. I mean, it's not done. I like my steak pretty rare. I'd say medium rare. But you like yours medium, right? You all. See, I like steak like that, obviously. I mean, I like it like that, but it can maybe go on for like a little bit longer if you want to. How colorful. So 
so I'm about to get in bed now. Um, I actually self tan, so that's why I'm wearing <laughs> long sleeve, long pants. Uh, yeah, because we're actually going out tomorrow night with some friends after work. So I'm actually going to work kind of early tomorrow just to make sure I'm off in time. Um, so I'm actually getting up at like 6.30, which I'm usually getting up like 7.45-ish sometimes. 7, between 7 and 7.45 usually. But yeah, my hair was a wreck today after kind of working out with it. I wore a hat on my run, which was like a mistake because it made my head like extra sweaty. And I just washed my hair last night. So, oh well, I kind of don't care because for tomorrow I kind of wanted it to be like loose, um, wavy kind of curls. So yeah, I just packed up my stuff um, and I'm just like, I feel so good that we've been like moving and getting our bodies going and actually sticking to working out uh, lately, but obviously I'm not going to be working out tomorrow. <laughs> it's not in the plans, but I'm glad we've stayed so consistent and it's just just makes me feel so much better. It's really just a matter of like getting back into that routine and actually like getting up and going. That's the hardest part, but once you do it, it's like so worth it. So yeah, I'm feeling great. I actually think I was able to like stretch out my legs and I like kind of rolled them when I was at the gym uh, to all, like all my shins to help them feel better. And I think it really did help and just like stretching them out in general. Um, even though they hurt really bad, like, when I'm running, it's kind of, um, getting better, like, after the fact. I'm not as sore. I definitely need to get some sleep since I'm getting up kind of early, but I will talk to you guys tomorrow. So I'm vlogging on my phone right now because I didn't bring my camera with me today. I was actually really rushing this morning. I didn't get up when I even wanted to, but it's fine. I still got off on time. Uh, I was just trying to get there a little bit earlier, but just got ready. We're about to leave. I'm heading to my friend's house or apartment, and then we're gonna be going out, so... Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching. I say bye.